गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट दिस इज योर कंप्यूटर क्लास एंड इन टूडेज क्लास वी आर डिस्कस अबाउट द चैप्टर नंबर नाइन इंटरनेट ऑनलाइन सर्फिंग एंड इन आवर प्रीवियस क्लास एज वी ऑल नो दैट पॉपुलर इंटरनेट सर्विसेज वी हैव डिस्कस्ड एडवांटेजेस एंड डिसएडवांटेजेस ऑफ इंटरनेट ऑल्सो डिस्कस्ड potential threat by using internet netiquettes now email and its future millions and millions of computer with internet access communication with each other around the clock means computer are connected with each other through the internet internet has transformed the entire world into the global village by providing numerous way to interact and communicate we can communicate communicate with the help of internet with various ways with the help of whatsapp with the help of facebook and other many communication ways one of the most popular way of communication is email we can communicate with an emails that is discussed in detail in this chapter email stand for electronic mail it is facility on the internet to send and receive messages anywhere around the world in the real time it works like the conventional correspondence but it is instant and convenient the best part of email is that a single mail can be sent to a number of person at a time means we can send a mail to number of person at a same time with one click we can attach attach photos videos or important data along with the, our messages these extra files are called attachment now what is email account in order to use email facility on the internet first we have to create our personal email account like i i already discussed in your class how many of you have email account so for this features for this communication we have our personal email account we have to select a username that is email address and provide us select a secret code password along with our particular like name address and date of birth that is very necessary there are many website on the internet which provide us with the facility of free email account the popular sites are www.gmail.com comma www.yahoo.com and www.redifmail.com so what is an email address an email address consists of a username and a domain name a username is the name of a person account by which the server identify him on the website whereas a domain name is a unique name that is identify a website or a web whenever we create an email we get an email address on which people send their mails every email account is associated with a unique email address which means that no two ident uh, individual in the world can have the same email address so every email is unique now how to create an email account let us understand how to create an email account and get our email address connect to the internet open the website www.gmail.com and click on the create account link and proceed in the next page a registration form will appear fill that registration form choose a username and password accept the agreement and email account get created if the entries have been filled properly if you fill the entries properly your account will be created after creating an email account it can be used to send and receive email to those the email account one must have login with the username and the password the login slash sign in system of the different mail accounts may differ but they all have the uh, identical features they have have the identical features now the inbox 
it display information about all the received mails each message had a display the sender name subject line time and date when the mail is received and sometimes the size of the message too to read uh, my mail click on it the mail will be displayed in the new window you can watch it now compose or write mail to compose or write a mail to compose a mail one has to create or click on the compose option or any other similar option it will open a new window with the following components first of all it will show two here we can type the email address of a person to whom we want to send the email now the cc in this field one can specify the address of the person to whom one want to send a copy of the mail the email address mentioned in the field are visible to all the recipients of the mail it stands for the carbon copy now the bc c it also used to send a copy of the mail to uh, several people but the email address mentioned in the field are not visible to the recipients of the mail the bcc stand for the blind carbon copy now the subject it is a brief description of the mail which gives an idea about the messages that what is in that message what is in that mail now messages you can type the message just like a normal letter with greetings one or more paragraph and you your name at the bottom you can also format the text using the available features sending email after composing an email click on the send button the email will be sent to the recipient or the recipients if you want to send to single person then as a recipient or if you want to send to one or more then it is recipients now attach a file how to attach a file in an email the email provide the facility to attach a file for high speed delivery and where in the world attachment of file of an email is very easy way to send important document to file which can be a photograph a video music letter or text to attach a file of email follow the given step click on the attachment file icon like this it's on whatsapp also is the same symbol on the toolbar at the bottom of the compose window the open dialog box will appear browse through your files and select the files you want to like to attach click on the open button the file attached to your mail now click on the send button always remember you cannot send executable files or messages larger than the 25 mb or as an attachment nowadays internet provides some emerging technologies which that enable to transfer file beyond 25 mb some of the most popular services are we transfer and send space wet ran tran wet transfer wet transfer is a free online file transfer service that enables you to send the files up to 2 gb from one system to the another we can send with the help of wet transfer both the sender and the recipients are required to have an email address to the transfer the file the recipient receive the file through mail all the given step to transfer the files click the link www.vtransfer.com and click on the add file button and select the file from the open dialog box add the recipient's email address in the friend's email text box add your email address in your email box type a message in the message text box if required click on the transfer button the recipients will receive the mail containing the file which can be easily downloaded which he can download easily now re replying and forwarding email the reply option is disabled when we open an mail it is used to reply to a received email click on reply button or type in a mess text and then click on the send button the forward option is used to send any received mail to other email address adding a signature to a mail a signature is a bit of a person personalized text such as it, such as contact information of a, or a favorite quote it is automatically inserted at the bottom of every mail you send to create a signature follow the step 
click on the uh, settings icon in the upper right corner of the window and click the setting option locate the signatures section and enter the signature text in the box next to the signature field click on the save change tab now managing context address book when we start using email our contact list also grows gradually and it is beyond the capacity of a person to remember the email address of each contact fortunately every email program provide an address book where we can store the email address along with contact details such as phone number address birthday anniversary etc to add a contact follow this step click on the contact option press now present under the gmail tab the contact preview window appears click on the add new contact button press at the bottom right corner of the windows type the contact name and click the create button the edit contact form will open add the contact information in the respective field of this form and click on the save button now groups we can create groups within we can club and store similar type of contacts example family and email with email addresses of a family members friends with email address of friends offices with the email address of the office colleague etc creating group of email contact is very easy and interesting click on the contact option present under the gmail tab contact preview window appears in the left main click on the group option and select new group from the drop down menu a new group dialog box appear enter the new group name in the provided space click on the create group button you will find the new group added in the left main to add contact in that group click on the add person button once a group is formed you can easily send mails and share document in it with multiple people at the same time now how can you log out or sign out after doing all your work in the email click on the sign in button once you have finished reading or signing the email this option brings you out from your email account it is good practice and quite important practice and quite important to sign out to to your email account keeping it very view the security perspective if you are always sign in any miss grant and can interfere with your account setting and can also send abusive message to the member of your contact list in your name thus misleading the recipients this can land you in deep trouble so student that's all from this chapter if you have problem any problem in regarding this chapter you can ask me this is this chapter is very interesting you can create an email account with the help of the given information in this chapter so student thank you for listening thank you